I'm Chris. And I'm Jen. And this is the Play Date. We're from TTPM, and this is where we show you the newest and hottest and coolest and funnest stuff. Well, that's a that's a flashback thriller. Yeah. I mean, that's like what thirty years ago or something. I, I used to know the whole dance pretty well, actually. I could tell you were pretty <laughs> pretty good at that. So we've got a lot of great stuff to get to today. We've got so much fun stuff. Mm -hmm. Of course, Batman v Superman opening yes. next week. So there are a lot of really cool toys out there. You know, one of the things that we I'm going to give you a Wonder Woman here. These big figs, these 19 inch so big awesome. figs from Jack's Pacific. Mm -hmm. uh, they actually have 30 inch big figs. They have all these kinds of things. These are like posable. Yeah. Yeah, They're like big figures, uh, room decor, they can fight, uh, so... <laughs> No. Do they fight in the movie? Do we know this yet? We don't oh. know anything about the movie I mean, yet. I know those two guys are going to fight, probably. Okay. So, so here. So that might be a little bit more are you, are you Ben Affleck or, or Henry Cavill? I'm more of a Henry Cavill supporter, oh. but... Okay, here you go. So, <laughs> Batman's the best! Batman's the best! Oh no! You're bending for the waist! Okay, so that's what these are. These yes. are really cool. They're $19.99 and they're very durable. Woo. So we can get rid of them. Now, for... <laughs> Just went for a little fight there. <laughs> they fly. Yes, Yay. of course. Okay, so we've also got from Mattel, they're doing collectible dolls. Yes. Of course, Barbie and Ken are appearing as Wonder Woman and Batman. These are for the adult collector. Mm -hmm. And they're really, really nicely articulated. And um, the facial sculpts are also really nice there too. And one of the things I love, she has a certificate of authenticity. <laughs> it says... This certifies that your Wonder Woman doll was created through the collaborative efforts of designers and artists at Mattel. So you know it's the real deal, which is really yeah. kind of cool. But these, these are actually very, very nice. Yeah. And they come with stands. Mm -hmm. uh, Wonder Woman has her shield and her sword. Yeah, and her and lasso of truth, lasso which I'm super truth. excited about. Why? Why? Because not all the kids' toys have the lasso of truth going on there. So, oh. just to be legit. But you know what? She's had that lasso of truth for a long time, mm -hmm. as we just learned in DC Superhero Girls. Yes. She's had that for a long time. So these guys are really awesome, and they are $34.99. So they are a little bit more expensive, but these are really for the kid who wants to display as well as play. Yeah. Now... We've Barbie's also, going secret agent. Barbie is going secret agent. We've got this really cool item. This is called Barbie in Spy Squad. Now she looks like a really traditionally cute Barbie doll, mm -hmm. but the story is that Barbie is a secret agent. She's a gymnast who becomes yes. a world-class secret agent. And we have to put in her little thing here. Yeah, which is a tool you'll also see in the movie. Right. So, so there she goes. She's gonna. Oh, Whoa. it works better on a flat, hard surface, which we'll get. <laughs> we'll get. We'll get to cut away but for that. It's still a really cool toy, and. Um, but you know, it is really yeah. cool. We really, we really kind of like this. I mean, again, the whole idea is she's very poseable. Her, her, uh, her trench coat, her, her pink secret agent trench mm -hmm. coat comes off to reveal. Wait, we got to show you this. Her, uh, her gymnast, her gymnast outfit. Nice. So she can be, she does with all kinds of great things. With a, with, of course she's got a utility belt. She's a spy yeah. and a superhero. Yeah. Uh, she does all kinds of things. Okay. One of my Stick favorite, bot. favorite this toys. This is one of Chris's absolute favorites. I love this because it's so creative. And StickBot last year became really huge. It was hashtag StickBot, mm -hmm. StickBot Studio. What they've done this year is something that just blows me away from a technology standpoint. StickBot Studio Pro is green screen shooting on the go. Now, it used to be you could do green screen, but you'd have to take the film into, mm -hmm. you know, you'd shoot it against the green screen and then do a process called chroma keying where you take that out. This actually uses any photo from your, from your phone or the library that they provide you and does green screen on the go, which is pretty amazing. So I really I really love it. There's all kinds of great things with it. Yeah, and it's also got a blue side on the reverse. So if you have a stick plot that is green, you could still use this. Right, and it, it yep. very good. <laughs> but it's really, really fun and it's really, it's just super. And you know, if you go to hashtag stick plot Stickbot, hashtag Stickbot on YouTube, you can see some of the amazing things that kids have created yeah, with this. It's incredible. Uh, we really we really love this. Okay, I'm gonna move this away because Literally. we are we are under threat right now. We are under threat. Zombie SWAT toys from Factory Entertainment. I love this. Chainsaw, machete, and a baseball bat with nails in it. So if if you are getting, if you are getting a, <laughs> if, if you're about to be attacked by zombies or Jen, you actually have something you can do. And by the way, zombie is our secret word. Zombie. <laughs> Don't forget it. I, I love these. These are so much fun. I love these. Now, the company recommends them for 13 and up. So, but I, I definitely think there's... I 
you know, they're, they're soft, safe about. foam. And you know, I have never recommended to anybody that they get a chainsaw for their kid. A but toy chainsaw <laughs> that hasn't been a success. Kids love chainsaws! I mean, pretty cool sound effects too. I'm totally in love with these things. Yeah. I think they're really just, because you know, I mean. And zombies are really in right now. I mean, you've got all those TV shows going on. But zombies aren't really real. So it's really all about imaginative they're play. They're not? No, what? sorry. Uh, spoiler alert! <laughs> ah! Okay. So what do we got going on over here? Okay. Finally, you're, you may want to use this on me. Okay. Uh, this is called Wethead. This is the coolest game. Now, you remember Pie Face from last year? Yeah, yeah. Which is all about, like, if you get it wrong, something happens mm -hmm. to you. In this case, you're not getting a pie in the face. You're getting water all over your head. So you put, it, to you put it together. You've got this uh, twisting thing here. You actually add water into the chamber. We, I brought along water because we're actually going to do this. Ah! Well, this Let's is get, definitely going on Chris's head. This is get. Oh well, you know you, the thing is about it is you take turns. So, okay. so okay, I'll take the first turn okay. because just in case, I lose. But so you know you it gets more stressful with each one. You have to strap it on, spin the spinner. Oh, I have to pull one pin. Which pin shall I pull? I'm gonna pull this one. Oh, no water. And no water. So, then it's Jen's turn now. <laughs> okay. Let's see. And it's really, you you, you really don't know because you can spin it around and do all kinds of other things. Oh, you got to pull one pin. I'm going to pull this one. Yes. <laughs> and you know, one thing is, it's like the funny part about this is you actually, when you take the pin out, you, you actually wait. You don't really know because it takes a moment for mm -hmm. it to do it. Okay. Pull two pins. Ooh. Oh no. Okay, where are we? Okay, we're gonna pull this one, which is kind of cool. And then we're gonna pull this one and see if we didn't get the water out. No. Nope, we didn't get the water out. So, oh wait, we did actually get the water out. I lose the game. <laughs> like I said, it takes, it takes a couple of of seconds for the water to start coming out and then it goes all over you. Uh, Super fun for summer though too and honestly this is one for I put Molly. way too much water Apparently, in Apparently you like literally got me soaked too. Okay so we got some prizes to give away and I reset my hat because I got something to tell you before the end of the show. Go ahead let's go what are we giving away? Okay oh taking a Wonder Woman Barbie in Spy Squad the doll. Oh, oh, this is the Batman voice, voice changing mask. Yeah. This was the number the number one toy on our site in March for the mm -hmm. Batman v Superman. We've got the Batman v Superman uh, armored Batman. We've got Batman. It's a highly posable figure. Mm -hmm. Oh, yay! We've got Stickpot Studio Pro and, and Stickpot. A, a Stickpot, <laughs> uh, so you can do all the things. Oh, and these are really cool. These From are these are cool Disney Infinity figures. We've got Nick Wilde and, and Judy Hopp. Both from uh, Zootopia, Zootopia which is a wonderful awesome movie, movie, by the way. Yeah. So let's move these out of the way because to get these, I will tell you how to get these. You want to watch this on our video on our site and in the uh, space where it says enter the secret word, enter the word. Zombie! You have from March 18th to March 24th to enter. And remember, enter it on our site. Yes and not on the YouTube. Now, I want to show you one more thing because in our review of this great game called Wethead, mm -hmm. we actually show you the cheat that will allow you, or the hack rather, that will know. always know where the right, where the, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're going to always know where the one that gets the water to, uh, lets the water go is, and there it is again. I love this game! We'll see you next week. Bye. <laughs>